Hello there, everyone. My name is Crazy Killed, and today we're taking a look at. There is only one perfect solution, but there are clues that will try to trick our team. Constellation. So, what exactly do we do for this? First, we need to identify what this constellation is, and then press one that's in the same um, sky map, the sky quadrant. Excuse me. So, how do we identify what star it is? First, we need to we need to count the number of stars present on it. Um, the way how you can identify the amount of stars on it is by the little circles that are on it, including this one. So, in this case, we have four stars on this one. So let's go down here, and as you can see, there's a huge, huge uh, bunch of star symbols that have that have the amount of stars that are on them. So, like 20 stars, 22, and a 31 out of nowhere. But since we have four stars, let's take a look at the four star area. Um, the best way I would describe this one is it's a triangle. It's sort of an obtuse triangle. In this case, it's going to be Triangulum uh, Austral. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go back up and find Triangulum Austral. And that's going to be its symbol we're looking for. So now we're going to take a look at the sky map and find that symbol in here. So it's right here in Sky Quadrant 3 or S quadrant. So now looking at the four symbols, we have to identify which one is in the same quadrant as the uh, same symbol that we found here. So looking at this, I would describe this as like a spoon, sort of. It is not there. Um, looking at this one, uh, I do not see it anywhere either. This one has an M with a swirl at the end. It is there, right here. So since these are in the same sky quadrant, that is the one we will press. And that's the solve module. That's all we really need to worry about. So let's count this number of stars. There is obviously a lot more than just four in that one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And I don't really know how I would describe this one because it's rather an interesting one. Um, but in this case, there's only two situations with 15 stars. This one is the Orion. So, we're going to be looking for this symbol, the three O's. Let's go back up to our sky map. Looking for three O's. I don't see it anywhere. Here it is, in, in N quadrant one. Looking at these four symbols, which one is in the same quadrant as this one? It'll be the first one, because this one's right here. If you know your astrology better than I do, excuse me for that, but whatever. So we will press this one. Now this one has three stars. One, two, three. We'll go down and look for this. Three stars, and it's kind of like um, an upside down L, I would say. So here, Coma uh, uh, Berenses. Berenses. And this is its uh, symbol we're looking for. Go back up here. It is right here. If I could click on it, just follow my mouse. Um, so finding the same symbol that's in this same quadrant right here. It will be this one right here, because that's on our module. So we'll take a look, we'll press this one. And that's the solve module. Let's see what's on the back. Quite a few. So this has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven stars. And it's this one. Safe. The way how you want to describe these stars and symbols, it's totally up to you. Because I don't do this constellation, I don't do this module often, but I understand it enough. So, we're looking for this symbol. It looks like a crown with a backwards K on it. Crown with a backwards K. Right there. It'll be right here. So, we're looking for the one that has the same symbol in it. And it's this sort of swan. It's got like a two, and then it has a little hump in there. So, 
press that one, and then Salt Mod. There will always be one of the four. There will not be two of them in there, so you won't get that opportunity to press uh, two. So, do the last one, and then that should be it. One, two, three, four, five. Five stars. It looks like the beginning of a trapezoid from if you, if you tilt it. Uh, and then it cuts off, I would say. Five stars. So this one. Microscopia. It looks like a microscope. How ironic. We're looking for our microscope. Here it is. In this quadrant. So, let's look at these other symbols and try and see if we can find it. It'll be the three-way arrows. So right there, because they're in the same quadrant, we'll press that one. And that's pretty much it for this module. There's no unicorns or anything. It's just um, finding the same, uh, finding the shown constellation and which one is in the same quadrant as it is. As it is. So, um, if you enjoyed this module, Please leave a like, uh, subscribe, and possibly share it. I personally don't care what you do with it, but any any uh, feedback will always help me. Especially. So, thank you guys for watching. Um, I plan on doing a lot more tutorials, and as always, happy to be. See you around.